Hello beautifuls, this is Aroma here and welcome hey, back to the Tim. Detective Pikachu. Tim. Oh, okay Pikachu, calm down. Are you ready, Tim? Let's head over to Baker's place. They should be done with their analysis of the locket. Yeah, that locket we gave them yesterday. I wonder what kind of secret it's held. Who knows? Let's hope it had some clue for us. Let, it, let us get going. Couldn't speak for some reason, which okay. Uh, I, I thought it was the other door. We headed to the Baker Detective Agency to ask about the locket. I feel like the locket was a camera. Who would have thought yeah. the locket was a camera? But here they are, the pictures we developed from it. And you know what this tells me? Harry almost had it figured out. Look at that. Yep, that's most likely R. And some warehouses, too. It's too bad we can't tell where this is. You know, I've seen this building before. This is Rhyme Wharf. We'll go check it out. The wharf? The culprits could still be there. The seafood Maybe stuff, using right? it as a hideout. <sighs> Makes sense. It smells there. Oh, no brother. one wants to go in there. I hope he doesn't start with that hole. It's too dangerous, Spiel. All right. Take Axel Gore with you. Uh huh? You remember, it's my partner. Where's your partner? I'm not going to tell you to stop investigating, Tim. But since you were attacked at the TV station, it's the very oh, least I are. can do. Axel Gore is quite dependable. If you run into any trouble, send it back and I'll get help. Axel, Cell! We will, Aww. Mr. Baker. Axel Gore, thank you. Cell Gore. Tim, wasn't this guy really shy before? Hope it's not a problem. What we'll be mean? on our way. Well, I guess we don't have much of a choice, do we? I mean, aren't we all shy? Come on, Excel I'll teach you the basics of detective. Or work. nervous. Sell, sell. And then we open up and talk a whole lot. Me. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna just go to Rhyme Wharf. We have two more chapters to go after this, eight and nine. I'm pretty sure we're not gonna beat it in time for the movies, but at least we'll be close enough. It's a lot bigger than I thought it was. No kidding. Let's look for that area in the photo. Tyler wants to go on a cruise wow. so bad. Wow, what a huge ship. It's probably here for the parade the today. The Disney one. Now that's <laughs> a true luxury liner. I'll bet the food is really good too. Not to mention the coffee afterwards. Sal. Sal Garcel. I wonder how much what? a cruise costs. Bitter. Coffee is practically a detective's trademark. Sal Gore. Pikachu, what are you doing? Talking about coffee? Just giving Excel Gore a lesson in detective etiquette. Right. Anyway, we should probably start gathering testimony. Sal, Sal Gore. Sal Gore, Sal. Uh, huh? Where is he going? Where's Excel Gore going? It said it's not good at communicating. I guess it really is shy. Well, that's no good. It's supposed to be here helping us out. He's a ninja. He's gonna scope out, alright? Hey, man. The hey, point of view here is weird. I swear that it's so good. Well, I hope you know why we're here. To investigate, to find out where Harry went. Escape warehouses. Uh, I kept the photo of the warehouse, but Selgor is holding on to the rest. What? How are we supposed to gather testimony then? Well, I guess we need to find Selgor first then? Yeah, I bet it'll come out if we go to an area with fewer people. What the fuck? <laughs> Excuse me? Let's start by gathering testimony. Kinda of figured. You didn't have to tell me that, Pikachu. We're like, we've done this for seven chapters now. Well, technically six, because we're in seven. Hello? Um... You need to find this warehouse, because you're looking for someone. The photo doesn't really tell me much. There are so many warehouses around here. I could talk to him a champ or that's not the champ um the evolution of him are there really that many warehouses around the wharf yeah it's called the warehouse area for a reason oh i know take a look at this a map thank you oh you can have it have a look here the three areas around the wharf are all, are all full of warehouses if it's only three areas i think we can cover them all how many warehouses are there in total i'd say about a hundred Each area has at least 30 warehouses. We'd be here for days if we want to check all of them. Well... Uh, 
Okay, that was weird because it said we didn't talk to him about it. My choke. Great, a physical labor. But does he enjoy it though? You're bored because the chef hasn't arrived. You want to get uh, get to work, huh? Oh, I guess. Your job is to move the containers off the ship. It's good training. It makes everyone happy. Well, that's good to hear. Okay, Pikachu had something wow. to say. This is a huge freighter, isn't it? You know, stuff from all over the world gets brought to this port. Usually when I think of the wharf, I think of like a seafood place. Oh. Yeah. According to the map, the warehouse district around Ram Wharf is divided into three areas, and each one looks pretty big. How do we find the exact warehouse that's in the photo? I think we need more information. Let's find out more about the warehouse district itself. Um, Gina hey. so. just disappear all of a sudden we're a team, right? Now let's see what clues we can find in these photos. Okay. Oh, I could click. It's a warehouse. It could be their hideout. We need to find this building and see what's in, what, what it's hiding. For that, we need to gather testimony. You'll leave that to us. Don't worry, that was a plan to begin with. Wait, go back to this one. He's a pretty buff guy. His shoulders seem twice as wide as mine. Let's hope we don't have to tangle with him head on. If we do, you'll save us. Gee, thanks. It feels so much better now. Because he sounds like... Oh, hey, it's front face. Looks like he was speaking with Cleet. I would say Cleet. Keith. Let's see if we can find out more about him, too. Okay. They're being, boxes are being carried in a conveyor belt. Uh, it looks like they're carrying things that don't go on the conveyor belt. But man, look at those Pokemon. Bet they're all sweaty and stinky. Oh, a scientist. Uh, th I th had thought Carlos was the only one working with art, but I guess they had other help too. Carlos had given Keith his research data, right? It wouldn't be surprising if Keith had shared that data with this guy. Um, wonder what those machines are for. Are they both the same thing? Could they be machines that make R? Who knows? What's wrong, Pikachu? You've got awfully quiet. I don't know. Just looking at this gave me the feeling that I have something important to do. Is it a memory of when you came with Dad? You no, know, it feels too odd for that. Like, a Pokemon was floating in that? This, literally, this, when I first saw this photo on the, hey, there's Pikachu. Um, when I saw this photo, I thought that was like a tube of carrots and celery. Just to buy it. Just to carry around your carrot and celery in a tube. <laughs> this has got to be R. I didn't realize they make so much of it. Uh, Harry must have found this somewhere in the hideout. There's more photos? Okay. Right. I could never get bored looking at cool machines like this one. Oh. Wow. Oh. Aww. He's so amazed. Uh, the case notes. There are three areas with warehouses. But where's the warehouse in the photo? Let's gather information. Oof. This is gonna be tough. Alright. Ooh! Ooh! Rotata! We'll go anywhere for food. <laughs> what are you running around for? What? You wanna get on a ship? You mean that container ship there? Oh, so there's a lot of tasty things on board. Please don't tell me you're thinking of sneaking in there as well, Pikachu. Of course not. I may like good snacks, but not enough to become a stowaway. You're trying to get into the ship by climbing the rope, but you always get bounced back near the end. There's some kind of decoration or something on the rope that must get in the way. You're never going to get in if you just keep trying the same approach. See, if you don't succeed the first time, you need to stop and think about why. And then change how you go about it. If you keep that up, eventually you'll succeed. Got it? Yeah, that's a spirit. It didn't really help us there. That's fine. Okay, he's just fall. Hey, Pelipper! His beak is extra large. <laughs> uh, it says it's a carrier. It takes letters in its mouth and delivers them to the ship. All the way up there. Seems like a lot of work. Yeah, I'm impressed it doesn't just swallow the letters. Okay. 
Do I have to go all the way up there, dude? Hey, you! It's dangerous around here. We're loading the containers right now. Trying to get in our way, okay? Um, you want to know which warehouse it is? You need more. You'll need more to go on than a photo. It may help to figure out what kind of goods are stored there. Oh, sorry. Thanks for the advice. Seems like a photo isn't enough to get a lead. Um, each area handles slightly different goods. Pink areas A and C dealt, dealt with food. Thank you. Well, it looks like these warehouse areas store food. Mm -hmm. Hey, I know this blonde guy. Could you tell us more about him? He drops that pretty often to load the goods. Do you know where he comes from? I guess either area A or B. Why do you think so? Oh, it's because he's always comes from the south. The southern road connects the areas A and B. Okay. Thank you. Hey, mans. My champ. Really great at physical labor. Uh, work? Hey there, I take you work here too. Enjoy every minute of it. Minute oh, hey, it's legit. The background changed so there's physical cargo. It's suddenly got a lot of energy. Yeah, very dedicated. Oh, and then he's going to work. You don't work, you only have fun. Oh, I get it. You work as a carrier. It's not so much work, but more of a hobby. Well, I guess that's good. Well, Tim, it sounds like the man in the photo with Keith has something to do with the warehouse after all. I wonder who he could be. We were told he comes here often to load up the containers. That's right. If we could figure out what's in the containers he deals with, we might be able to narrow down where the warehouse is. Good idea. Let's give it a try. Now, let's look into these containers. Alright, I guess I hit my case notes. It seems as though the man in the photo shows up around here a lot. Let's go gather testimony. Alright. Can I go in the cargo? No? So. Oh, sorry to bug you while you're working. We're trying to figure out what was it. What, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> he asked you to carry some of his containers. Really? Um, you wouldn't forget a person with such wonderful muscles. Well, that- well, what kind of luggage did he have you carry? It smelled really bad. Oh, you got too excited and accidentally dropped the container, huh? And its contents went everywhere. It made the whole area stink and you got scolded by the guy, too. Sounds like you had a rough time. I wonder where the con contents are. Stinky goods. Okay. Is the other one coming over? Or is it just chilling? Hey, man. Um, the containers. You need to know what goods he deals with. Well, I can tell you he always uses blue containers. Don't know what's in them, though. Thank you very much. Hey, don't mention it. You know, I bet the Machamp would know more about him than I do. We were staring at him a while. The last time he dropped by, mu maybe it be his mu must be his muscles. Why are you just telling me everything, by the way? You don't know who I am. Did I already talk to this one? Yeah, I assume so. Oh. No, I didn't. Do you know anything about the containers this guy deals with? He was speaking to one of the Machamp you work with. Thanks for the info. Oh, then I already talked to that one. Alright, well then, how do I get up? I don't need to see the photos. Hey, man. What am I doing? I'm waiting for the notice to come in. See, I'm in charge of the communication between the container ships and dock crew. So once we've got the goods ready, I send the notice to the ship staff. What do you mean, send? Use a shout out, or is there some sort of signal system? Oh, we use Pelipper. We put the notice in its beak and have it fly over to the ship. Uh, you say you're looking for this warehouse. Sorry, I can't help you there. All the warehouses in this area look pretty much the same. Um, what? B is machinery? Or A and B are machinery. This is where they store machinery. Okay. Um, people in the photo? You want to know if I recognize these people? Yes, if you know even one of them. Hey, I think I've seen this pair somewhere. Really, please tell us anything you remember. Let's see, it was about two months ago. They were unloading a machine from a ship. A machine? What kind of machine? I don't remember what it looked like, but it must have been expensive. The scrawny guy in the photo kept nagging the carriers to not damage it. What in the world did Keith bring in? I bet it's something to do with R. Um, do you want to know more about the container the man in the photo is dealing with? Well, I only saw it once, so I can't say much. Anything about the good handled in this area in general would be very helpful. 
Uh, they're sort of bright color. The blue containers have a, you know, I can't remember. Let me check with the guys on the ship. Hey, Pelipper. Did you fly over there with this letter? Okay. That's pretty cool, I guess. I want to watch him actually take the letter out. Can we see that happen? Ah! <laughs> Let's come back. Pella, pella. Pella, pella. Uh, we don't mean the letter to carry if you don't know that's cool. Okay. What do you say? Welcome back, Pelipper. I see you brought the response with you too, Pella, pella. Great, thanks, Pelipper. Well, kid, we've got the ants right here. The blue containers are for food. The red ones are for oil. Oh, shh. Hold on, I gotta write this down. I assume. I assume I had to write this down. Last time, I still have the freaking notes for um the dancing, or not dancing, the the bugs, bug Pokemon. Their camera directions. R equals oil. Green equals machine. And blue equals food. So they're bringing in food? The letter was all slimy with trolls. That's how they always communicate. Alright. Thank you. Is there anyone else we can talk to? Hey, Rattata. Uh, so you're trying out new approaches, like I said. What's your new method? If you fail to try a different rope... Uh, yeah, that's good. Hang in there. You succeed eventually if you don't give up. You sure sniff around the containers a lot. Something about them interests you. The blue container has a really strong smell, so you're checking the other containers to see if, they, if any of them smell too. Does it smell that good? Oh, it's not like that. It's really strong, but it grows on you, huh? Wow, the blue containers must really stink. Okay... Yeah. Gather some information. Oh, I guess we've got all the notes. I'm wondering what kind of stuff this man works with. Is there any testimony about that? Um stinky goods. Um I mean a blue container. What stuff is that man working with? Uh it's food. We were told that whatever it is the man deals with is very smelly. Also, it's the blue containers that smell. From that, we can conclude the man in question is dealing with the blue containers. The blue containers help food. Mm -hmm. So just food? That means he's in Warehouse C. The man's good. Excuse me. <laughs> All right. Hey, how do I get to warehouse C? Um, what? I'm I'm skimming through him because I guess this guy didn't really. His help isn't really helpful because we already got all the um answers. But how do we get to warehouse C? Go on. You can tell me what fashion <laughs> you think I am. I was like, wait, what, what is he doing? <laughs> All right. Um. Regarding the warehouses, let's look at what we know. Which testimonies will help us? think which area is it that has the warehouse we see in the photo probably see what no seems the testimony and answers they aren't meshing with one another are you serious right? okay um the goods and man was handling were food 
keep them all because they're carefully. They contain food they're taking to the southern road. Now let's think. Which area is it that has the warehouse we see in the photo? I'm gonna choose A then. I know where it is. The only warehouse area that stores food and is accessible from the southern path is area A. Okay, let's head there now. Oh wow, that's true. I didn't account the the south part. Now, it's time to get moving, huh? So no more dawdling. All right, let's go. We found one of the warehouse in the photo. I thought it was going to be C because they didn't mention about the machinery any further. Based on the photos left by my father, we headed to the warehouse area. They didn't mention the 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 yeah this machines like the warehouse further. In the photo. Uh -huh. Look at all that security. Something fishy's going on. We've got to get in somehow. 